India's fast-growing economy is home to more unbanked people than any other country. Since 2009, India has added new pieces to its financial infrastructure. It has built three interconnected layers, a biometric identity database, simplified payments addressing, and market-wide digital payments interoperability. Together, called India Stack, these new layers have the potential to bring dramatic change. To see how it works, let's meet Seema, a garment worker who migrated to Bangalore from a rural region of Odisha. As a migrant, she does not have a permanent address, and banks often require multiple ID documents to open an account. In 2009, the Indian government created the Unique Identification Authority of India which has enabled over 1 billion residents, including Seema, to easily obtain an identity number linked to their biometric data. Using only her identity number and biometrics, Seema can now open an account quickly. And the electronic identity allows financial service providers to instantly conduct KYC checks. A second layer of infrastructure allows SEMA to link her identification number, phone number, and bank account number under a simplified payments address. This address can be easily shared with her employer to receive her salary digitally. The third layer is a market-wide interoperable payments system. SEMA can now use her phone to send money instantly to her mother, who has also recently opened an account at a different provider. Her mother can withdraw the funds in rural Odisha using only her ID number and her fingerprints. Two additional layers are being added. The digital locker, where people can securely upload digital copies of personal documents, such as academic records, vehicle registrations, or birth certificates. And a new system for e-consent, enabling people to selectively share their personal documents and data these new layers would allow Seema to share her key financial documents to apply for a loan or access other services. Together, the layers form a new national infrastructure connecting business, government, and hundreds of millions of people like Seema to the financial system.